Hi guys! I just want to give you some ideas about the photography props for the BGD dolls. Some ordinary things you can buy in a shop for your doll and can be easily converted to your needs for your doll. Halloween soon there is a perfect skeleton for your photography prop. For example, he is about 40 centimeters, I think, so he's kind of MSD size. And I bought it today just thinking of making a quite funny picture of my BGD hugging this skeleton. Next thing I want to share, maybe you've seen it somewhere in the party department of any shop. This came in pack of six. It's like a trophy and I think this is just a perfect size for your photography prop. This looks quite good, you just need to put the plaque in here. You can create it for yourself and ta-da! Next thing is I bought this from Vox, it's the shop in the UK and it's only a pound and I thought it's gonna be perfect. It's perfect size for decoration, for for example diorama for the dolls. As you can see I haven't even taken off the package yet, I bought it just recently. Another thing I want to share with you, um, this wings are usually used for to photograph babies and basically they put this on a baby's back um, so it's like an angel but this is perfect size for MSD doll it was only 79 pence so it was very cheap if you wish I will leave you the links to things I bought next thing I want to share with you this lovely hat again this is more USD or 2 MSD size this is just a clip hair clip I will take this clip off and I will have a hat for my doll and this was again less than a pound very cheap I know it's maybe it's easy to make a hat but this just looks perfect and it's already made and they come in a variety of colors so I'm quite happy with this buy. Next thing, you probably all know this lamp, but it was the pound. And uh, which shop? I think it's a Tiger store in the UK. But the, you can buy them online. It's just a lead lamp, and it comes. It comes like that. I think you can use a variety of scales, not in the cell MSD, but any, like I said, a pound, cheap and cheerful. This is a Mac laptop, which is actually a mirror. I'm not going to blind you. This is a mirror, and this is the keyboard. Um, so, yeah, just a mirror. I think on eBay, I bought it, two of them I bought each was one pound fifty eight if you buy it from if you buy it specifically from b g d related shop it will cost you maybe about five to six pounds maybe even more but this is called a uh, mac miro and it's and this is a laptop next thing um this is more Halloween related but I bought it a long time ago I was thinking to make a prop like a diorama in the room. It's like a hanging skeleton in the cage, skeleton head in the cage. So just an idea really. <laughs> Spooky prop. Um, next thing, I bought this on AliExpress and it is quite heavy but it was very cheap. It was maybe about two to three pounds. It looks really realistic and it's metal. So, as a prop, as a weapon for your doll, maybe to hang it on the back of the doll, um, wearing a fantasy costume or something like that. I think it will be pretty good. 
Next thing is sushi mat. I I bought two of them, and this well, I was already using some of my photography things. It's quite nice mat, and probably will suit the room with. Asian style room maybe like a tea ceremony or you can use it as a backing so it can be not only the floor it also can be a wall and it's quite good it's very sturdy it's the sushi mat you can buy them anywhere even in the grocery store next thing again related to uh, Halloween I bought this pumpkin light, it was last year though, but I bought it specifically not for lights at all, I bought it for making potions. These plastic containers or plastic pumpkins um, can be used as a potion bottle because I'm gonna just attach the label here um, and make a stopper and it's done. And the rest of the lights I can use for anything else, maybe for Christmas. So that's my intention, well, since last year obviously. Next thing I bought it, I bought it from the party department of the range store, which is based in the UK, but I'm sure you can get it from anywhere else. It is candelabra. Um, they come with the candles, but um, you can use it as a photography prop. You can attach a longer stick or on the pole and create a standing candelabra. Or you can even cut this out and create a hanging one. Just an idea. Or just put it on a table. Probably suitable more for SD size. Next thing I bought on eBay just a few maybe weeks ago. This lovely die cast um, pencil sharpener vintage telephone and it's perfect size for MSD. Uh, maybe it will be alright for SD, but maybe it will be too small, not sure, can't really say anything, but it's perfect for MSD size. Oh, it's been worn in here, but it was used. I think in total I paid about £5 for it, including postage, so it was a bargain, considering it's a die cast. Next thing I want to show you these flowers I bought in Hobbycraft, it's, well, it's a UK hobby store. It's a paper one, they came on the card like that, I already detached it. Um, it's a perfect size, I'll show you why I bought it. Because I purchased these two vases uh, from the charity shop. Two of them were about 99 pence and they're perfect props, they can, they're more likely to be a uh, floor vases rather than the table but still I don't think this just looks okay no maybe it's all right but yeah just an idea watch for these sort of small jars and bits and bobs in charity shops next thing I want to show you I bought it in Aliexpress a long time ago it's quite interesting thing, you just press the button and it's changing colors. I think it would be perfect for DIY or if you want to make some sort of fantasy, I don't know, setting and you just cover the bottom and you just create kind of, I don't know, like a table so it sits in the middle and glows like that. Or it can be just purely plain lamp. Next thing, it's a camera. I think it's more suitable for SD size, but MSD is okay. This cost pittance. I know some people selling it for quite a lot of money for what it is. As you can see, I broke this off because it's actually so it's a keyring thing, like a keychain thing. Uh, and actually it does look, I remove this thing and I press the button, it slides up and makes the noise as well. I'll put this back, it's like a battery protector I think. I just add all little tiny things and 
this is still new I bought two of them this is another thing which can be attached to your keys but I'm gonna use it for props it's just a little notepad but you can use it as a book you can change the cover here if you want and just make it into something completely different so that's that next thing is the holy bible again um, it is actual bible um, printed and everything um, and you can use it as a prop again as a book it's a perfect size you can display it like that or I don't know you can remove this thing and just have it as a normal book it's quite good for what it is for, for, for the price it was again less than a pound I think about two of them for a pound on the Aliexpress so that is that another thing I want to show you are the frames these tiny frames they usually come from the Christmas crackers so look for Christmas crackers we've got that, like things like that I was actually specifically looking for it last year and I did get these lovely frames they just perfect because as you can see the size is perfect so that's this idea for photographs another a pistol it is a keychain key ring again I cut the actual attachment from here so I cut the rest of the chain away it's quite heavy so it's more likely it's gonna be just displayed rather than held in hand it's quite sturdy next thing is Christmas stuff it's they what they call they call like really clear water drops you can use them as the cane or stick um, fantasy kind of style magician thing or for the bed um, like for poster bed the snow queen fantasy thing <laughs> I don't know really I just bought it and I, I will make something with it I'm not sure what yet another thing as you can see um, I haven't detached this yet it's very heavy it's a fantasy weapon I think it's from Warcraft Minecraft I, I'm not sure I'm don't I'm really not into these kind of things but I think it's just a weapon from that kind of game in the world it's very heavy again and I don't think it can be used um, to hold it in hand it's more likely to be just hanging somewhere um, so it's quite heavy again I bought it on Aliexpress another thing I want to share with you these glasses uh, these are just embellishments um, for cards if they're metal and it's perfect for most D size you need to attach the wires in the ends in here and you got your own glasses or you can add even some kind of you can use this plastic type um, containers cut out some plastic glue in the back or even maybe painting it in black acrylic paint first and then attaching it so you get real kind of glasses kind of glass in the glasses and again they usually come in pack of six or eight and you can get them from eBay um, pretty much cheap and cheap again another thing I want to show you it's a bath it's a plastic bath it's obviously a decorative thing to put things like shampoos and toiletries in there and I bought it for two pounds from Vilka it's another shop in the UK but I'm sure you'll be able to find it in China with love somewhere and I'm gonna paint it white I'm gonna decorate it it's more MSD size so as you can see Another thing I want to share with you, I love just Halloween and I buy stuff, but 
I bought these sweet little horns. They already fixed with some some kind of barrette. So that's that. And okay, and the last but not least, it's um, again Halloween stuff. But I really like these small tiny creatures, or creatures they called. Um, I had them before, they're kind of like a rubbery thing. You can attach them to the clothes, you can make spooky clothes, or you can actually put them in a jar, on a glass, in a glass jar, and you get some spooky potion thing. Or you just can purely just attach them to the clothes of the door, or even to the face. On this positive Halloween note, Thanks for watching and, and have a good day.